Hi there, Simon from Manchester Wine School here. It's, um, yeah, I mean, it's uh, the end of the first proper corona-ish week for, for me. And uh, it's been, there's been some good bits and there's been some not so good bits, but uh, I am going to have a good evening this evening because, um, first of all, Chuck, chucking away in the oven. Uh, there's some lardons on the stove. I'm going to chuck a few beans in there and do something um, that's probably going to be quite unhealthy, but rather tasty. If you hear any sizzling, no, maybe not, you're not, not going to sizzle at the moment, um, then, uh, then that's what it is. But the wine I've got tonight, um, it's uh, La Cote Sauvage, Keran, uh, made by a producer from a very exotic place called Cheadle. Um, it's Boutineau. Boutineau is uh, one of the UK's major importers and uh, they're based in Cheadle, but they've got wineries in various parts of the world. And I think probably the one that they are probably proudest of is what they do in Keran in the southern Rome. So uh, they've, got, they've got their own winery there. I think they've got their own vineyards there. And this is La Cote Sauvage. In the hills surrounding our Keran winery, we naturally tend plots of southern Rome varieties, Old Vine Syrah, for finesse, more verde for a touch of spice, and low yielding Carignan Noir for balancing freshness to blend with a ripe black fruit from Grenache Noir found on sought after Argilo Calcare limestone pebbles over clay. clay. That's what's in there, what's in the glass. It's lovely, wild, herby, uh, rich, fresh. Uh, pungent and uh, yes give me more give me more type of red wine and uh, it's it's been a, a sunny day here but um, the evening is cool and uh, this is exactly what I want to drink so I'm just gonna have a quick slug and it's rich and it's ripe but 14 and percent alcohol it's not shy on that front but there is this lovely olive dark, um, deep berries, brambles. It really feels like it's a good wild wine. It feels like it's been drawn out of the countryside rather than made in a wine factory. Be quiet, Lardons. Um, and uh, I'm, 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 I think it's gonna go terrifically with, uh, with my chicken tonight. Um, what I particularly like about this is that um, this is their Keran. There is a lovely uh, Coderon village that they, they also do and um, under the Cote Sauvage label, there is an upmarket version of this, which is called, is it called Les Cis or something like that, but there's a good range. And if you go into Morrison's, uh, you can try uh, Le Verdier Keran, which is one that they, they do for certain markets and do for, um, uh, for yeah, it, it, I think it's only in, in uh, Morrison's in the UK in terms of supermarkets, but available on other, other markets. Um, but also, when they bother to put the cork in, uh, they bother to put a B on there, and actually they put a B on the uh, on the uh, top of the capsule as well. Manchester B. Uh, so uh, this is what Manchester should be drinking on uh, those warm days, cool nights, and uh, perfect for lockdown. I'm going to go and tend to my lardons now. Uh, whatever, wherever you are, hope you're safe. Hope you're having some good food, good wine, good company. See you soon.